Hello, this is David, and this is a tutorial on how to create a simple arpeggio in Sonic Pi. This is probably the first piece of code that you would write to create an arpeggio. Take a ring and play through it. But if you want to change the chord, you would have to change all the notes, and it's hard to see what exactly is going on. Now we will keep the basic structure, but we will change the ring. In Sonic Pi, you can do this which creates a ring containing all the notes that a C3 major chord has. And you can also specify how many octaves you want. So now we have a C major chord over three octaves. It accepts notes or MIDI numbers. and it has a drop-down menu, so you can choose from all the different types of chords that Sonic Pi offers. And you can also use variables to control the sound from somewhere else. Now it uses the use root variable, Now this variable can be changed from this live loop to change the sound. Now there is one more thing that you can do, and that is where the list operators come into play. If you only want 8 notes, you could use take 8. You can also use shuffle to create a random arpeggio that repeats. You can also use reverse, or you could use drop to create an inversion of the chord. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments and subscribe for more Sonic Pi tutorials. Thank you for watching.